You're gonna be a partner. One person's gonna be down in your back. Do this slow. All we do is stretching and trying to loosen up. Person on top, around the neck, back the arm. First thing he does, roll in towards me. He wants to get his elbows down on the mat. His left hand comes around as far as he can. Push off with his left leg and roll me towards his shoulder. Same thing. Turn in. Grab here. Turn me to the chest. Then roll. Okay, try it. Which side are you going to go? Remember, my left hand, I'm going back with his neck. Roll. Here. Here. Pull. Okay, try. Oh, three. In essence, you can grab your own arms. Would be good. Yeah, that's right. If you get deeper, it's better. If I hold back, it's going to be right in your face. Here, grab. Remember, my left hand goes under, and my palm's going to be facing up. I have to control and grab this arm. Under. Lock. But as I turn, I'm pulling with this hand. As I pull, watch my left hand. It goes here. But I have to get my face out of there, then turn. The important thing is control this other arm. Palms out and hold. Then my chest is real tight. Okay? Uh, yeah, right there. Going that way. Okay, now listen. You reach around the stomach. As you roll, remember you have to be, you're starting like this. You have to end up on, a, on an angle. You're going to have to end up on the side of his body. Watch, as you turn, head goes first. Roll the head and sit back with his head already. See the position of the ends up? He's across, hands down, and control the other arm. Watch, one more time. Head has to go first. Around, under, control, continuous turn. Okay, Mate, move off the side. Just do the roll just by yourself. This is important. He starts from here, he has to end up on his front part of his body, just like that. Body, you're turning inside. One more time, do it again. From here, control, head goes first, roll, flatten out. Okay, let's try it. Yeah, that was good. Huh? Now watch, as you roll, the head has to go first. Shoot the head down, his head's already out. You got a continuous roll. If your head's on, if his face, his body lies in your face, you won't get that pivot. One more time. Let me stop. That's a bad angle. No. <laughs> With a camera. Oh, <laughs> okay. Roll. Turn. Flatten out. And lock. Good move. Excellent. Start again. Quickly. Thanks, guys. Let's go, guys. And lock them. That's why I was like, the first did it, that's why I did you. Instead of pushing the other one. Almost. Same, this time you're going to grab the belt. My left hand is going to come in first. Now, my left hand comes in and on top. The same way. Here. Pull. Lock. Turn down. And spread out. Again, right hand. Pull. As I pull, 
My forearm controls his back so he doesn't get away. Lock here. Back of his head. Hold his head. Pull here. Good job. Okay? Let's try it. Thanks. Side and pull him over. Get right there now, stretch out. Stretch it like that. That's it. Get your chest way on top of him, right? Right there. Do it again. Pull. Yeah. Boy, and push him down on the head. They have to move their body and follow. Watch. Here. So he's real close. By the time he's on his back, his chest is going to be on him. Okay, switch. Wait, wait, stop, 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 okay. Do it like this, yeah. Hand under neck, rolls, and push. See, he's on the side right away. He's not gonna move. That his shoulder is sort of controlling his hips. So he can't roll away. This part is down on him. Okay, try it one more time, and we're gonna switch to something else. All right. Okay, now this time we're gonna come in with a choke. Now watch, again, my left hand's gonna come across I'm going to grab his optimal lapel. See this? Optimal lapel. Basically, I'm going to set it top of his head and pull. Here. Pull. My right heel is going to the back of his armpit. My left knee is going towards my right leg. So I'm squeezing his head together. My left hand goes in front of my thigh. Grab your optimal lapel, sit on his head, and pull up and choke. OK, turn the other way. Again, right hand, left hand under. Pull, right heel under the armpit. My knee goes towards his head. So I'm squeezing his, his head to my ankle and my leg. Left hand in front of my thigh, sitting on his head, pulling up the opposite lapel, and squeeze until it choke. So pull, sit down, grab. Squeeze the legs. Keep your weight on his head now. OK, let's try it. Thank you, guys. Oh, wait, stop, stop, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you can lock him. Yeah, you can lock him. Like this, go. Right, right here. Yeah, like this one. Put your right heel and back it up. Get down lower. Get down low on your knee. Yeah. Lock. Get your left knee right by his head. And keep your left hand in front of your leg. Grab the opposite of the pelt. Pull up. Squeeze the legs together. Pull up with your left hand. You feel it? Yeah. Amazing when you can't squeeze your head, your knees together. And pull up. Sit down with your head. You don't want them to come out. Pull. Yeah, put him back right there. You get your left hand right by your head. Now start squeezing your legs together. Slide your left hand right in front of your thigh. In front of your thigh. Grab your opposite lapel. Squeeze, pull up, and sit down. You feel it? Yeah. When you sit down, bang, right now. Okay, now this is the other part what we call sankaku. Right hand, left hand. Again, same entry. I'm going to come down. Now I'm going to reach down, try to grab his lapel, put a choke. He tucks his chin in, now his hand's in the way, but I can't get it. Don't waste time. Left hand, grab his arm. I'm going to pull. As I pull, I'm going that angle. Watch my right hand. My right hand is in right away. As I roll, comes in. My left hand pushed down. Notice my right hand goes backwards, this way. Holding on, locking, lock his leg. I squeeze my legs, going for a choke. Push the arm down, that's an arm bar. Lift my leg up, get the opposite lapel, pull, it's another choke, or into the pin. Again, one more time. 
Right hand, left hand, pull. Sit down. Can't get a choke, grab the arm. This way. I'm going back to the side. If I go this way, I'm going to lose it. But it's important, control the right hand. Pull back. Now as I roll back, watch my right hand. I have to control this arm. Roll, lock. Push down, time up. Straighten the leg out, lock it. Choke, arm bar, another choke, then into a pin. It's easy, it took me 10 years. <laughs> okay, let's try it. Who's your partner? Go ahead, try it. Yeah, now you grab here. Yeah. Pull. She's your right hand right through. That's it. Put your hand down, backwards. Yeah. That's it. Now open your leg. Grab. Pull. Yeah. Put your hips this way. Yeah. Keep, yeah. keep it on your leg. Now. You roll back with me now. That's it. Shoot your right hand through. Push it down. Right. What? Is it here? Push it down. Turn the hand backwards. Now grab it. Yeah. Oh. oh, yeah. You have to go that out. Now reach out, grab his arms. Set your legs out. Get his hand under his neck and do it. Yeah, like that. Lock it in. Yeah. That's it. So keep it on your leg. Push down towards your knee. Yeah. Sorry about that. But yeah, when you do that, get way up here. Okay. You can come up and grab his leg. Grab my, grab my, up. Grab yeah, see him grab his leg, even that leg. Wrap your hand around his leg. And that's an old side corner. Yeah, you just don't have any room over there. Okay, go down. Try it. Lock it, grab his arm, roll to the side. Yeah, push your right. You can be on your side now. Push your right hand right through. Over here. No, your right hand. Now, his hand goes backwards. Now, with your left hand, grab his belt. Put it into your right hand. The other way, turn your hand in. Put his thumb and forefinger. That way. See how you know, get much tighter. Now, from here, you get this arm. Keep it, keep it away from you. He has to be flat on his back. Yeah. Okay, now reach. Grab his arm. Pull it in back of your knee. Stretch your leg out. Now lock it. Now lock it up again. Now squeeze. Pull on this one. Pull it close. Push his knee, his arm towards your knee. Push down. Let's get up. Come on. Let's break his arm. Now lift your leg up. Grab your You know what? You can close up a little bit more. Or get around so you can see a lot better. There's a lot of small things you have to know. Notice his leg. He's sitting on top of the head. He's got this leg locked into his arm, right on the armpit. Now he reaches over. Some of you are turning this way. What's going to happen? This guy's going to be right on top of you. Pull on that angle. Pull back. Control the right hand is right through. So before he even hits, you can lock and control with your right hand. Left hand reaches over. Tie it up. Now get the arm. Straighten the leg. Lock. Move your hips. Sometimes you got to move your hips back. So the bottom leg is right under his neck. The choke is real, a lot stronger. Now from here, go right to the arm bar. Grab the wrist. You want to keep the hand, his arm, on your leg. If you do it from here, it's not going to work. It'll be like 15 years, and this guy's going to be a lot stronger. Keep it down, push, and control. Then, reach under your own leg. Grab the opposite lapel. Pull, stretch your leg out. Now right from here, if you can't get anything, you can get right to Grab this leg. It's what do you call it? Oh, say, come, you already get the pin down. In this leg or the opposite leg, and just turn your stomach so your body's facing on top of them. Or you can get out into the pin. But once you get this control, you don't want to lose this. Watch, one more time. Again, pulling on an angle. Okay, you do it. Keep your head tight. Roll on an angle. Right hand is through. Lock it. Time up. Grab the arm and control. Like at the arm bar, the choke. Turn over right at the top. 
That's the pin right there. You squeeze the leg tight, you can also get a choke. Okay, let's try it one more time. You know, this afternoon I'm gonna work with uh, Sheldon Marr. And I'm gonna probably do the standing, he's gonna do the groundwork. See, I'm a, I'm a gentleman, I do real nice techniques, and he'll kill you. But you gotta come in and watch these techniques, they're, they're awesome. Okay, thank you very much, you guys.